Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Billy aka Lefty Heat and I was lucky to find one of these Pokemon Go Plus devices at GameStop. I actually had to pick up in store so I pre-ordered this online and picked it up then in the store and it was actually pretty much the last one they had. So let's get right to it. We are unboxing this and then I will give you guys my honest review because I'm going to go try it out right after I record this unboxing. And I like how it gives you that kind of retro feel to the box. This reminds me of back in the day, back in 1998, when I used to open up the Pokemon Booster uh, sets with all the cards and everything. It's very, It looks very similar to something like that. We've got the instructions. I already read up on this, so I know exactly how it works, and I'll tell you guys how it works right here, right now. We also have a band that it came with, and my friend was not too crazy about this. He is more so probably going to put it on his shirt because it can clip to a belt and or pocket on your shirt. Uh, you do have the option to wear it as if it's like a watch. And I really like how Nintendo's logo is on the back of this. Let me get into focus here for you guys so you can see. Actually, let me take this out real quick. We have the uh, piece that connects to the battery, so once we take this out, it'll start working the device. And we're going to have to connect this then to the Bluetooth on my phone so they'll have connectivity between the two. So it's now blinking blue and I'm going to grab my phone and we're going to try to, to sync this up on camera, see how it works and show you guys what exactly is going on. And alright, we are going in and right now I actually uh, have been playing Pokemon Go quite a bit and I'm at level 20 as I record this video. We are connecting the Pokemon Go Plus to Bluetooth so we're pairing the two devices. I have an iPhone 5 and it is successfully connected. That did not take long at all. I also have power saving mode on and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like then on the screen. The Pokemon Go Plus also vibrates telling you when a Pokemon is nearby. And so yeah, as you guys can see, the top left hand corner of the screen, you can see the Pokemon Go Plus. And we also have this band that you could wear on your arm or hand to use as a watch. You can also clip it on your belt because it has a clip on the back of the device as we've seen. I do not really think this is necessary for me, but let me know if you guys would like to use this to connect your Pokemon Go Plus or maybe wear it. The vibration is actually pretty loud and it's kind of like an earthquake, like a Pokemon using the move Earthquake. but. It's pretty loud, so you guys are definitely going to hear it. I really like the look of this. It looks cool. It's kind of like a novelty to have with the game. Is it necessary? I would probably say no, but it is definitely fun to have. Here, I'll show you guys. A, uh, a tentacle actually showed up, and the Pokemon Go Plus is now connected. So now it's blinking green when it sees the Pokemon, and it'll actually tell you with a line where exactly the Pokemon is. You click it once, and now it's trying to catch it with one of the Pokeballs I have, and it was not successful, so it blinks red, so then that Pokemon ran away. If it was successful, it would blink blue and back and forth to red too. You can catch Pokemon without actually looking at your phone. As you can see on the screen, there's the Pokemon Go Plus showing you the exact spawn location of a certain Pokemon, probably Abra in this picture. And I'm just, you know, I'm a fan. I've been a Nintendo fan all my life. I'm a Nintendo ambassador, and I'm really happy to take a look at this. Would I recommend it? I would say if you're looking to get something cool and you can even grab one of these at the store if they're even available, I'd say go for it. But I do not think this is necessary at all as of right now to play the game. I would give this, if I could give it a review, an 8 out of 10. I think it's going to help me because I can't always have my phone out all the time, especially, you know, if you're going to and from work, you're on your lunch break, or whatever you may be doing. For me, this is going to come in handy to catch those Pokemon because I go with the, I transfer them out, I go with the candies to evolve my other Pokemon, so this is going to be very helpful. You also really need the Pokeballs because you cannot use Great Balls or Ultra Balls as of right now to catch your Pokemon using this device. I'm also looking into if this device will capture any Pokemon you do not have as of right now. I'm I'm only seeing it will allow me to capture Pokemon that I also have already or I've seen them already in my Pokedex and it's very tough it seems to also capture Pokemon that are very high CP just using Pokeballs so I hope they give us some updates with this device. All in all I would say it is pretty cool let me know your thoughts down below in the comments and I will see you in the next video. This is Billy aka Lefty Heat signing out. Video Game Heat Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. I post new videos right here every week. I'll see you next time.